Hello everyone, it is I, Monsi, and we are back with some more Spider-Man Web of Shadows. In the last episode, we got the introduction, the, uh, the meme of Spider-Man being all depressed and shit. Very emo and melodramatic. And then we also beat up some thugs right here at this hospital with, uh, alongside our good old buddy Luke Cage. And also there was some, uh, slight audio issues because this game is, well, the PC version is a little bit buggy. I can't say what the, the console versions were, but I implemented some settings change some things around and hopefully it should be fixed it's not as laggy as uh, it was in part one i can easily see that much stop five crimes okay i guess after that then we'll uh, meet meet up with a uh, luke cage the grunts well uh obviously for the most part are nothing even the symbio grunts are kind of fodder and also those tokens will are basically like little xp bonuses get enough of them and you'll level up to the next uh level so they're always a, a plus to get which is why i was so adamant about getting that one in the be in the beginning oh there's another one mine i also really like the sound effect the okay what is spider-man wall crawl please thank you fighting on the roof eh you know, the, the thing I like about these old Spider-Man games is that they had no real concern or the, the developers didn't care enough to animate Spider-Man saving them in case you knock them off the, the roof. Whereas in Insomniac Spider-Man, they automatically get webbed to the ceiling, not the ceiling, but the, the buildings in case they fall off the building. Which, uh, you know, is cool because obviously Spider-Man doesn't kill. But in these older games, man, is it hilarious seeing them just fall off a three-story building. Three more for level two. Nice, okay. Obviously not all of the lag is gone because this is a really old game. 2007, I believe, or 2008, one of the two. I fixed most of the lag, but not all of it, obviously. The game is running fine, for the most part. There we go. Give me this. I have to say, the web swinging feels amazing. Did I already mention that? I feel like I already mentioned that. Man, these are just everywhere. One more. Gimme. The lock-on is helpful, but it's... Uh, sometimes it's a bit jank. Now, obviously, the web swinging in this is not as intuitive or as... Uh, or you see, like that, I still run into trees as Insomniac Spider-Man, but, uh, it's still... Okay, that's a, that's a minus one point. I'm just swinging from the air. It's not like Spider-Man 2 where you, uh, or really any other Spider-Man game where you swing from the actual buildings. The webs are attached to the buildings. I believe there's a mechanic that lets you climb the web, which I never knew of beforehand. Which is actually kind of cool. I just forget what it was. No, that's not it. That's not it either. Oh, that's that's cool. A is a speed boost. If you swing while pressing A, they clearly took that from Ultimate Spider-Man. Which is cool. I'm not giving up on this uh, web climbing thing that they took from Spider-Man. or ult no, There we go. From Ultimate Spider-Man. So you can climb the web. It looks kind of jank doing it. What's up, Cage? Good job, Spidey. Thanks to you, the gangs are thinking twice before having to shoot out in the middle of the street. But we have to keep up the pressure. Tell me about these gangs. They are engaging in a number of activities dangerous to the community. Your unique skills could be perfect for stopping them. Chat about the gang war. Luke, you've been at this for a while now. Trying to get these gangs to calm down, I mean. It's an ongoing job, Spidey. I had a piece working, and someone decided they were disrespected. And now they're trying to get revenge. That's just stupid. That's life, man. I grew up in a nice, quiet corner of Queens. So you have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> nope. <laughs> That's one way of saying it. These kids think they haven't got any currency beyond respect. They don't see any way out and no future beyond what they can carve out for themselves. 
And their solution is to turn the city into a war zone? Yeah. They don't think beyond today. That's why I'm out here, to show them there's another way. There's a future. Well, I've got your back, man. I want to help any way I can. There's some guys out here that need to get got, knock some heads together, yeah? But most are just guys who've fallen in with the wrong crowd. And they just need to hear some kind words. Hey, Luke, what did you mean when you said I had unique skills? Ah, uh, tutorial time. You have the potential to be a great fighter, but you need to use all your senses. Hey, I've got more sense than you. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> you know, my spider sense. One of these days, I'll think of something cooler to call it. But until then, fine. Good. You got an extra sense. Now use it to its full potential. What do you mean exactly? You can see all your opponents before they see you. Figure out who you take out first. And I need that exact skill right now. What do you need? I've got an informant in serious danger. There's a hit about to go down, and I have no way to spot the shooter until it's too late. But you... I could use my spider sense as a sniper sense. Nice. <laughs> exactly. And you can bet there'll be more than one. Now I'll tell you where the informant is, and then you can stick it out. Okay, let's do this. All right, mission activated. Go to the hit location. Got it. Whoa, was that a thing? It was. I knew it. Let's see how much... Oh, he looks so jank. <laughs> oh, man. I got no time for these crimes. Except I got time for that. It's mine. That flag looks off. This is the place. So many people, though. Spider Sense, do your thing. Press and hold LT to trigger Spider Sense. Alright. Spider Sense highlights targets blue civilians, allies, red enemies. Got it. Tap onto the informant. A vertical column of light highlights the locked target. I figured that. Tap L2 a second time to disengage Got camera lock. Informant. Now where are the bad guys? We're about to find out in a second, man. Okay. Okay, that's one, two, three, four. These aren't there really snipers. Are. More so just thugs. Stop the thugs before they shoot the informant. Ow, but that they're shooting me. There's one guy who has a lot of health. Is that the informant or is that a another dude? These guys hurt. They're just thugs. I was beating the crap out of them before. And now they hurt a lot. You all in one piece? Man, how are you big time? Don't thank me. Thank Mr. Cage. <laughs> That it? Oh, that was it. Mission complete. Go uh, get to the hit location. Yada yada yada. Also, my my face cam is blocking that. That's gonna bother me. Okay, that hopefully will be better because I I hate blocking the screen with my ugly ass face. Blocking important information that I think should be seen. That always happens when I'm when I play a new game. I mess around with the where the camera should be. And I never, I never figure it out until at least the like the second or third part of a of a series. Mine. There we go. I'm starting to sound like a crackhead of going after these spider tokens. <gasps> okay, that is concerning. That glitching effect. Good job, Spidey. You really helped me out here. Hey, it's what heroes do, am I right? Hey, if you up for it, why not use that spidey sense to find more of these gangsters out on the streets? Take them out before they cause any trouble. Sure thing. Hmm. Thug bashing or save three civilians. Let's go civilians first. Spidey, this gang war is putting innocent lives in danger. I know. 
These guys shoot first and aim later. Now you need to get the innocent bystanders out of the crossfire. Will do. And then... Tell me about these thugs. What'd you have in mind? It's simple. Every time you take one of these dudes down, that's one less guy making trouble for everyone. Okay, you got it. Okay, Spider Sense 10 thugs. Mission activated. Defeat 25 enemies. Optional. Alright. I should probably. Uh, I should probably upgrade uh, first. No, not dealing with you. Not yet, anyway. Where's the hospital? Oh. I'm looking at it. Well, the icon, anyway. Mission completed. Spider sends 10 thugs and return, return to Luke Cage. What's up? Way to expand your mind, Spidey. Now, don't forget that Spider Sense will always give you the advantage. Yeah. It has saved me countless times in the past. And in the comics, too. Been watching you fight. You got tons of potential, but no skills. <laughs> Wait a sec. You said before that I had unique skills. I mean, you're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with everybody. With your speed, you should be coming in quick and getting out. How do you mean? I can train you if you're willing to learn. Sure. All right, let's do it. Okay, little dude, wait here. Now come at me from there, hard as you can. Go for it. Press Y to web the target. Web to target. Right before contact, press Y again to strike. That's oh. all right. Too it's early. A bit early. Oh, okay. Ready? Go. Okay. This one. This mechanic is pretty cool, but it can be a little Good. annoying, a little bit as you can attack. see. Ah! I can't do this. Come on now. Don't quit on me. Try again. Focus. Go for it. Maybe I just suck because. Oh, here we go. Press Y again. That was close. Try again a little bit later. Ready? The timing on this is very strict. Good. What? Wait a little bit before attacking. Go for it. Okay, too early. I gotta be close to Luke Cage. I didn't even press it. I did not even press it. Go. Okay. That's all right. It's a little bit early. Go for it. I gotta do five of these, Jesus. Okay. There go we go. Ready? Oh, there's a thing right there. Go. Hold on. You hear me, sir? Come at me from the air. Go <laughs> I heard. I heard you. I just wanted the token. <laughs> Good, just like that. Okay. That seems Ready? a little easier. Go. That was close. Try again a little bit later. Hmm. Go for it. Got me good. Okay. Yeah, that is very strict timing. Ready? Go! Well, at least it keeps me engaged. You got some moves, I get you that. I'm not gonna hold back anymore, though. Let's go. Okay. Go See, th it. this is also very interesting. Good one! Ready? Go! Mm. Good, just like that. Over counter. Oh, okay. Just before opponent hits you to over counter. Okay. Nice, Spider Man. All right. Okay. Ready? Go. It's gonna be tough to remember for me anyway, cause I have a poor memory. Okay. You're doing good against me. Now go out and show me what you got. Come back when you master this. I'll teach you some more. Mastered? I thought I was a master at it.
Luke Cage, also known as Power Man, received super strength and titanium heart uh, skin from a clandestine experiment in prison. Now free, Cage administers street justice with his fists and will come to Spider-Man's aid only when the web slinger is allied with people he has pledged to protect. You can find Luke Cage in the park uptown protecting the citizens there. Yep, if it wasn't already obvious. You get allies, you get more than just Spider-Man characters. Well, uh, I guess Luke Cage has had some association with Spider-Man. All of the allies will encounter have some form of connection to Spider-Man. Web strike 10 thugs. Web strike thugs 10 times. Okay. Well, we will do that next episode if Spider-Man can you... Well, as I said, we will be doing that next time. And that's... <laughs> That's just fun to do. Uh, anyways, I will leave it at that. If you guys like this episode, then please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on the social medias. I will see you all in the next episode. See you then.